Hello everybody, I'm Tony DeRazio from Jacob's Ladder Special Needs Fitness. This is Jake. This is Jake DeRazio. Jake is a certified group fitness instructor for the special needs community. We're going to take you through a workout tonight. We're going to use some equipment. Now, you may not have all this equipment, but if you don't have it, there's things you can do without the equipment. So we're going to start off with some loosening up. Ready, Jake? Let's do the good morning stretch. All right. Good morning stretch. All right, Jake, let's go up to some, uh, let's do some marching. All right, we're gonna do some marching. Bring the legs up. We try to do dynamic stretching, which means you're moving as you're stretching, getting the muscles moving, getting the heart rate a little bit up, getting the body flowing. March, baby, march, march. That away, that away. Okay, now we're gonna go into some Italian stallion, a little bit of boxing, air boxing with Jake. Ready, set, go. Do this for around 20 seconds, just to loosen yourself up. Jake is actually a certified boxing fitness instructor from the group called Down to Box. So we've been doing a lot of boxing in our time. All right, Jake. Very good, let's go to cross toe. Okay. Keep your arms up for this one. Arms up. Let's do it. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Nice. Eight. Nine. Ten. All right, okay, what's next? Now we're gonna do some leg lunges, just some static leg lunges, kinda. We're still moving, but we're not. Watch, watch how we do this. Go ahead, Jake, do five on each leg. One, two, two three, three, four, five. Good, now switch legs. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, now we're going right to the ball. We're going to do this workout, part of this on the ball. Okay, Jake's going to sit on that ball and do some sit-ups. All right, now if you, some of you don't have big balls like this one to use, but you prop, some of you probably do. So let's do sit-ups on these. One adaptation is you put your feet under a couch or something to hold them. Jake doesn't need to do that. All right, Jake, let's do two sets of, let's do a set of ten. Go. One, two, three, four. Not quite so far back. There you go. Five. Right about there. Six. That way, buddy. Seven. Yes. Eight. Yo. Nine. Ten. All right, pick up your things. Let's do a set of curls. Now again, if you don't have a ball, you can sit on a chair and do them or sit on a bench. All right, Jake, go ahead, buddy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten. Okay, now he's gonna he's gonna lean back and he's gonna do some uh, sort of like a bench press. All right, again, some of you won't be able to do this, but you can do it on a bench. It's better if you do it on a ball because you're getting a lot of balancing. But if you can't, that's okay. Ready, go. One, two, three. Nice job. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Okay, sit up. Now he's sit up on the ball. Now he's gonna do some overhead presses. Ten of those. Go ahead, buddy. One, two. He's using an eight pound weight. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 
Ten. Okay, weights down. Now we're going to go through that same that same thing again. We're going to do curls, curl ups. I mean, like a sit up. Okay, Jake, go ahead. We'll do ten of these, and we're just go repeat the same thing. Ready, go. One. Good job. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nice job. Nine. Ten. All right. Here we go. Now he's going to do curls. Set of curls. Again, use a chair if you want to. A ball's good though, it's good for your bounce. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Nice. Seven, eight, nine. Ten. All right. Now, what's next, buddy? Going back and doing a bench press? Bench presses. All right. Like a chest press. Ready? <coughs> One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. All right, sit up. Do the overhead. Ready? Go. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Notice some of the rocky pictures six, in the background. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. All right. All right. Now stand up. Put those to put the uh, ball aside, and we're gonna do the uh, overhead squats with the weights. All right. Now he's gonna do these. These are a squat. This is a really nice full body exercise. He's gonna do a squat and then an overhead. Go ahead. You're gonna go ahead and do ten, buddy. One. Trying to keep his back straight. Two. That's a good job, Jake. Away. Good overall body exercise. Four. Good technique. Five. I don't wait, buddy. Six. Yes, sir. Seven. Eight. Nine. And 10. Oh, that's a nice job. Now, hang on to those weights, and let's walk over to the step. We're going to do step-ups. Again, this is a, more of a total body thing. We're doing steps. He's holding on to the weights. Ready, set, go, buddy. One. Nice. Two. Nice. Three. Four. Nice. Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, rest for a couple of seconds. Hey, you want to put the Rocky music on while you're resting? Yeah. Go ahead. Shift it on, not too loud. I can see we got pictures of Creed, Rocky, 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 Rocky. We got an autograph to one of Rocky there. Okay. All right, Jake. Go ahead. Let's do 10 more of those. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, now, Jake, turn around one second. Now, here's an adaptation. If you're strong, go ahead and do, do a couple on the bench here, Jake. 
Now this is higher, so this is harder. You can do that. You can add the adaptation, make it harder for yourself. I don't wait, Jake. Nice work. Okay. Put your weights down. Grab your ball there. Turn that down just a little bit, buddy. A couple, couple notches down. There you go. Now we're going to do a uh, kettlebell workout for the stomach. Now you want to face, uh, face that way, buddy. Now watch this. You got about an eight pound ball there. He's going to bend down. Go ahead, buddy. He's going to raise the ball up right in front of him. One, two, he's getting squat in. Three, great for the stomach. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm going to do another set. Take a rest. You can run over and get your water if you want. All right. Never mind. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, now we're going to do a set of ball slams. Now, use a soft ball so it doesn't bounce too much, but. We're just going to take the ball and slam it. It's a really good exercise. Also, let off some steam. Ready, set, go. Now, you want to do is you want to slam that thing. Now, we've got a matted floor here, so it's not going to bounce, and that ball is soft. But it's a good exercise. It's a bo overall body exercise. You're doing a squat, kind of. You're slamming that ball. Good job, buddy. Five more. One. That particular ball changes shape a little bit, as you can see. Don't want to do this on your living room floor. We do have little bean bags or bags that you can use to do this that you could use on the in the living room or family room. One more? Or is that is that it? One more. Okay. Very good. Now, he's going to do some mountain climbs. He's going to do the first set. He's going to do them slow. This is a very difficult exercise. He's going to do slow mountain climbs. You're going to get on all fours. Now watch. Go ahead, Jake. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, now he's going to do fast, ten fast mountain climbs. This is a great aerobic exercise, and it's also a good strength exercise. Ready, set, go. One, two, better up, Jake. More, more, more buddy, more. Five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten. Nice job, buddy. Nice job. Okay. All right. Now we're going to come over here to what Jake calls the wall of fire. Now what we've got, what we've got right here, Jake, move that back. You're doing the stretch, the bands. You don't need that. Okay. So he's going to start at the bottom, and we've got these bands that hook up to these eyelets. And we're going to work our way up the wall. These bands you can get in a lot of places. This is a good setup you could have in your home. All right, Jake, let's do some curls. All right. You count them, buddy. One, two, three, four. So you get the right band for your strength. Five. 
All right, now switch is going to switch the band. One up, one eyelet up. And he's going to do a pull up, like, or a, uh, going to bring the bands up to his chin, basically. Sort of like you, uh, I forgot what the exercise you call us, what the weights is, but go ahead, Jake. One, two. two. That away, buddy. Three. That away. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. All right, buddy, go up the ladder, baby. Go up the wall of fire. You skip one, that's it. Now he's going to turn around and do another chest exercise. And those are going to go under his arms. Under your arms, buddy. There you go. There you go. This is like a, uh, another chest exercise. Like a, like a bench press type thing. Ready, go. One. Straight out. A little bit higher. Two. There you go. Three. That away. Four. Nice job. So you get the band Five. that fits you. Six. That you can do them comfortable with. A little bit of a challenge for you. Eight. Nine. One more. Ten. All right, there we go. Now he's going to switch the band. You see how easy this is? You can move through an exercise pretty quick. You can actually get some of these at five below. Then you got to put the eyelets in your wall, but that's not that hard. Jake's mom actually put these in. Okay, and we're going to do uh, punching with this, remember? Huh. Yep. So what we're doing here, just another form of punching. All right. Ready? Ready? Set. Go ahead. One, two, three, four, five, five six, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's do 20. 11, 12, 13, 14. See how that works? 15, 16, 17, 18. Nice. All right, now he's going to do the last one on the wall. He's do pull downs. You'll see what he does now. Goes right up the wall. There you go. That's another shoulder exercise. Here we go. Ready, buddy? Okay, ready, go. One. Nice. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Nice. Nice, okay. All right, Jake, the next thing we're going to do is the rope. Oh. All right, now, you may not have these kind of ropes, but you could literally buy a rope at Walmart or Home Depot and just hook it up somewhere in your house. We hooked ours up to the boxing uh, heavy bag. And wait, let's do uh, 20 seconds on the rope. Ready? If it goes, it will put two. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, 
seven, eight, nineteen, twenty. Good, Jake. Good, Jake. That's a hard exercise. Those are heavy. Now, I would say you start this off, you can get a lightweight rope, and it works just fine. Okay, Jake, go to the chin up. Now, we bought this thing. It's called the perfect pull up. You can do chin ups on it, pull ups on it. We're going to go for five here. If you can't do these, just hang on the chin up bar is a good exercise. All the way down, Jake. Let's have five, big buddy. Go. One. Go ahead, take a rest. Two. He's resting between. He's had a good workout here. Ready to go. Three. Four. Oh boy. Five. All right. Sometimes you got to rest in between, sometimes you don't. Okay. Now we're going to go on the treadmill for a few minutes. Some of you have treadmills in your house. Go ahead, buddy. All right, let's crank it up a little bit. We're not going to go far or long. I'm sorry. Let's go up to about three miles an hour. Now nah, you got to go faster than that. Come on, Jake. Crank it up. We're only going to go like a minute or two. Now, if you got a treadmill at home, that's great. We also have a stationary bike. You can use that. Some of you have stationary bikes. Get on that treadmill. This was a mostly a strength workout we did, or we're doing. All right, crank it up a little bit more, big buddy. Yeah. If you don't have a treadmill, you can always march in place. A little bit faster. All right, I got one. Go. Crank that baby. There you go. Okay, Jake, turn that baby off. Let's go over here. We're just going to show you a little bit of boxing. One of the best exercises you can do is hit a speed bag. Not all of you are going to have those. We understand that. But if you do, you can do it. If not, you can air box. Ah, uh, let's go a little bit faster, buddy. Come on, baby. That away. Yeah. All right, we're gonna go another 20 seconds. Ready, set, go, hit that baby. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going, keep going. Come on, come on, come on, buddy, come on. You gotta go, gotta go again, go, let's go. Come on, baby, that way. All right, now go over to the heavy bag. Some of you don't have heavy bags at home, but you might have them at your rec center. All right, baby. Do some left run. We'll get some one, two. Go. Come on, baby. All right, now come over, Jake. If you don't have a you don't have a boxing bag, you can still just do air boxing. We'll show you a couple things. One, two, one, two, one, two. 
Breathe, breathe, breathe. Show them the eight, the six punches. One, two, two, three, four, hook, five, six. Seven. Eight. Yep. All right. Jake, how about ending it up with uh, 10 push ups? All right, buddy. This was a pretty hard workout, as you can see. Ready? Do them uh, with a narrow. Go ahead, buddy. One, two, three, four. Breathe it. Five. Come on, you got five more, buddy. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, Jake, good job. All right, very good. Very good. That's our workout. <laughs> yes. Go ahead, Jake. Do a bottle flip. Oh, come on, baby. Can you do a plank doing a bottle flip? Got to get your other bottle. Go ahead. Go get your other bottle over there, that blue one. This we just do to play around. Go ahead. You can do it right there. All right, do it while you're doing a plank. Here we go, here we go. Ah, I got it. Okay, thanks. Found it, noggin.